And never before in American history have voters been this divided. But in Michigan, two neighbors are trying to set an example for everyone. Our next report gets you the complete story. On November 3rd, a polarized America will vote for a decisive future. In the election year, America has seen the worst. Racial tensions, protests against police brutality, rioting and looting, natural calamities, and numerous conspiracy theories. The citizens of the United States are more divided than ever. But in Michigan's Detroit, residents are not letting politics divide the community. Along Plymouth's leafy streets, houses with Trump 2020 signs can be seen next to houses supporting Democrat Joe Biden. For Plymouth resident Alex Morgan, the prospect of a second Trump term is a scary one. Morgan says that his neighbors, who are Trump supporters, will celebrate if he gets re-elected. Morgan says that it is great to have neighbors with different political views. Great to have uh, uh, neighbors with pol different political views because, well, hey, uh, I don't know everything, they don't know everything, and if we can perhaps be polite, have polite disagreements, that's okay. Um, and perhaps some for, for some for some uh, situations, you can you can connect with somebody if they're they like a certain candidate or a school board member, or maybe they know somebody that I don't know anything about. So we can we can also build some relationships that way too. Trump supporter Joe Court says that he had to make a lot of adjustments to his front yard as signs go missing. But everybody seems to get along. This is the first, like I say, this is the first election where it's gotten a little ugly, you know, and people are stealing lawn signs. You know? <laughs> it's pretty stupid, you know. Sign stealing appears to be widespread across the political divide. Biden supporters say they have also had their signs stolen. They say while they are furious with Trump's COVID-19 pandemic response, they are not interested in creating a rift with Trump supporting neighbors. Even if people have different political opinions, the vast majority of people, you know, do love their neighbors. I think that they need to find a better expression of how they love their neighbors. And I think, um, I think that this, this state can do a lot better. You know, obviously, by my political leanings, you know that I would support our governor. While there is a lot of hate among the two sides of the political spectrum, citizens in Michigan are staying connected despite the division. Bureau report, we on World is One.